how did you first find out about this UFC opportunity? So I, um, that's a good question. So I worked in New York City um, and I was going to grad school, was interning and working. And um, my boss there was sort of connected in the UFC world. And then I just started meeting people, some of my neighbors in my neighborhood, uh, all trained at Henzo Gracie's. So I would just like go here, you know, I'd go to dinner one night and I'd meet some people and, and go out one night and meet others or I'd be at work and be introduced to someone. And it just so happened that uh, a group of people I was, I had met at like a video game party, I think, um, eventually were like, hey, we have room for talent. We're starting this new uh, pre and post show for the UFC. It was actually UFC sponsored before they had a TV deal. Wow. And um, they're like, we're going to have. Uh, Dave Farah, host, who is still one of my closest friends today and, and such a talent in this world. And they're like, hey, Dave Farah's going to host. We're looking for a co-host. Um, my brother is a very talented wrestler. I come from a family of wrestlers and, and combat sports athletes. And they're like, do you think you could do it? I'm like, okay. So I just said, yeah, like I probably was not ready. And I, you know, probably should have like been more concerned. But I'm like, yeah, I think I can. And I just worked super hard at it. And so we, for like a year or two might have even been three years, we had this official pre and post show for the UFCs, which was very cool, all pay-per-views. We traveled the world and did them for the company. Um, and then once they got their TV deal is when I sort of moved over to working with Fox and a little bit more on the TV side. But yeah, the first the first opportunity was with a company called Heavy, who did uh, who did the pre and post show. Heavy.com, right? Yeah. Yeah. Yep. When was, what was your first memory of watching a UFC fight? Well, I remember watching Chuck and Tito, um, like, in someone's basement <laughs> a long time ago. <laughs> that's where I watched yeah, it, Yeah, yeah. Um, I remember watching that. Um, and then, honestly, I didn't have, like, a lot. I, I saw a couple. I feel like I saw a couple of Randy Couture fights because of the wrestling tie-in. A lot of people that were in my life and my family's life, you know, knew Randy or whatever it may be. Um, so I remember watching some of his fights. But I didn't have a ton of um, exposure to just the sport. Um, I had a ton of exposure to boxing, kickboxing, and wrestling, mm. but not the sport of mixed martial arts or the organization of the UFC. So probably not until I actually got the opportunity presented to me, not that I had had the job yet, is when I started diving in and being like, okay, what is going on here? Let me make sure I know what's going on. I knew a ton of the guys from like NCAA wrestling, and like, oh, okay, I know this guy and that guy, but you know, understanding this, the rule set and how the organization worked and everything, that was like a lot of studying and a lot of work to make sure I knew what the heck was going on. 